All right, Tony, just give it to me straight. Did you order the hit? You ain't got to answer that, babe. Don't worry about it, Gianna. I'll answer the question. I'll answer them. You want answers, Disco? I think I'm entitled to answers. Do you want answers, Disco? I want the truth. You can't handle the truth. Disco, we live in a world where there's lots of fucking criminals. And all them criminals have to be regulated by somebody. And I am not somebody who regulates them. Who else is going to do it, huh? You? Diego? How about you, Candy? You going to do it? I have a greater responsibility that you can't possibly fathom. You look at my bosses like we just sit around and collect money while you puff your weed and sniff your cane. You have that luxury, Disco. Then you come to me with some petty two-bit hustler's death, how tragic, somehow probably saved lives. And my existence, while grotesque and incomprehensible to you, probably saved lives, Disco. You don't want the truth because deep down in places where you don't talk about when you're at parties, you need me in the hood. You want me in the hood, Disco. We use words like real and gangster and no snitching as the backbones of a lifestyle that I live. You simply use it as a punchline. I have neither the time or the inclination to explain myself to a man who puffs the very weed which I put on the street and sniffs the very coke of what I put on these streets and has the nerve to question me on the methods of which I put it on the streets. I would just rather you said thank you, or picked up a pack and got down with the mob. Either way, I don't give a damn of what you think that you're entitled to, Disco. Did you order the hit, Tony? You goddamn right I ordered the fucking hit. Yeah!